Welcome to our Electrical Engineering YouTube channel. In this video, we will see an example on Equivalent Resistance. To download our Electrical Engineering app, you can visit this website link electrical-engineering.app. This website is specially designed for electrical and electronics engineering students. Question Find equivalent resistance between terminals A and B. Now, here for this network, we have to determine its equivalent resistance. Solution First of all, we will take this network. Now, here we can see this is a symmetrical network, or we have to apply rule of symmetry here. If we fold this network horizontally or vertically, then we get the mirror image. That means we, we can apply symmetry here. So, in this case, what will happen? We can separate these two resistances. So, it will become like this. And we can, now these two resistances are already separated. Now, we can also assume if we apply voltage between A and B, then same current fl will flow between these two resistance and same current will flow between these two resistance. So, that's why also we can separate them. Now, we can easily simplify this network and get the answer. So, here we can clearly see this 5 ohm and this 5 ohm, they are connected in series. So, it will be simply 10 ohm. This will be 10 ohm. Now, here also this will be 10 ohm and this 10 ohm and this 10 ohm, they are connected in parallel. So, this will be 5 ohm simply. So, it will be like this and it will be 5 ohm because we know that 10 ohm parallel with 10 ohm, it will be 10 into 10 divided by 10 plus 10. So, it will be simply 5 ohm. Now, this 10 ohm, 5 ohm and 10 ohm, they are all connected in series. So, here also we can apply the same formula and we get finally 5 ohm. So, this 5 ohm and this 5 ohm are connected in series. So, it will be simply, let's, let's take different color. So, it will be simply 10 ohm. And again, this 10 ohm and 10 ohm are connected in parallel. So, their equivalent resistance will be 5 ohm. So, let's redraw this network first. So, here we can replace this resistance. Now, here it will be it will be basically 5 ohm we can write so it will be simply 5 ohm and then next here also this 5 this 5 and this 10 we can replace them by a single resistance of 5 ohm It will be simply 5 ohm. Now, this 10 ohm, this 5 ohm and this 10 ohm, they are connected in series. So, it will be 10 plus 5 plus 10. So, 10 plus 5 plus 10 is 25, basically 25 ohm. So, it is basically 25 ohm. Now, this 25 ohm and this 5 ohm, they are connected in parallel. So, 25 ohm parallel with 5 ohm, it will be 25 into 5 divided by 25 plus 5. So, it will be 25 into 5 divided by 25 plus 5. It is 4.16. 4.16 ohm or we can say it is 25 by 6. So, this is the final answer for RAB 4.16. And this is how we can solve these types of network. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to this channel. And thanks for watching.